Good evening, children. Welcome back to one more session of probability. This evening we will discuss about dice. Probability is one of the chapter that we will go with full entertainmently with the chapter. So already yesterday we completed that coin which is related to 1, 2, 3. What is the formula of coin? 2 power m. How many coins you will take? That many. Okay now? Yes. Not really we'll discuss about that. Dice now. I think so you people know very well, very well the dice. The, let us go with this is only the dice. The six sides obviously, the six faces will be there. 1 dot, 2 dot, 3 dot, 4 dot, 5 dot, 6 dot. The formula of the dice will be there, whether you people know or not, I don't know, but that is the sum of the opposite sides must be 7. The only the logic is sum of the opposite sides means, suppose let us take this is the face. Opposite side means this one. Whenever you will add these two, you will get to seven. Or it won't cross. If you either these two or these two or these two. Do you have suppose any dice? Check it. Opposite sides, whenever you will add, it must get, it will get seven. If it is three, obviously the side four you will get. If this is 5, you can see here 2 points. If this is 1, obviously this side it will be 6. So sum of the opposite sides of a dice is 7. We will discuss uh, today. today. We will go with the dice. Okay? Yes. Probability <coughs> on dice. On dice, we'll go with the dice five. So, <coughs> if it is a one die, already it's a well known. For whatever the event, if you will take dice, coins, cards, whatever, you get that is. Only one formula that is probability of the particular event is equal to number of favorable outcomes by total number of outcomes. Number of favorable outcomes by total number of outcomes. Okay, children. So that is only the one formula for uh, whatever the event. Yes, let us go dice. Dice will have. 1 dot, 2 dot, you know that is 3 dot, 4 dot, 5 dot, 6 dot. Okay. Whenever you will toss the dice, otherwise you will throw like this. Toss a throw. Throwing is a correct word. If you throw, you can see on the top of the face, maybe 1, maybe 3, maybe 4, maybe 6, 5, 2. You can't say exactly. Called chances. Whatever you can see on the face, on a dice, on a face, at that time, that is a favorable outcome. Favorable outcome. Whenever you will see on the dice, five points, at that point, your favorite is five, indirect. Which you are going to write now, probability of getting five dots on a dash. That is nothing but 1 by total how many? 6. 5 is how many? 5 is a number, na? 1, only one time. So 1 by, not 1 dot that is. 1 by 6. Suppose if you will throw the dice, you got it on the face, number 2, 2 points you got it. What you will write? Whenever you will throw that one, you got it 2 dots, right? That is called one time only. 
so you can write that is 1 by total number of outcomes are 6 total number of outcomes are 6 suppose whenever next time if you will throw you can see that is a 6 6 number 6 points 6 stars 6 dots if you will see what is the probability of hitting the 6 dots on one dice 1 by 6 Whatever that six, five, four, three, two, one, whatever it will call as one by six because you are getting that is one time. You have that is only one time, so you will get one by six. Five is the number one by six. Three is the number one by six. Whatever the points you will see, that is only one time. It is there on a particular dice, so it is one by six. Adding of all these. One by six, one by six. How many? Six times are there. You will get six by six. That is one sure event. Compulsory, impossible event. Can you say that impossible of this on this uh, dice? The probability of getting seven points on a dice. Seven will be there. That no. Eight points no. Nine points no. So it is impossible event. That is called impossible event. Understand? Let us see here now. Uh, one dot will be there, two dots will be there, three dots will be there, four dots will be there, five dots will be there, six dots will be there. In this, the most important thing is, since we know the numbers, we have to go very lower classes. That is natural number. Prime numbers, composite numbers, multiples of two, multiples of three, four, whatever. So in these questions, how he will raise the questions? Let me see. That is now. That is. <coughs> see in this one, two, three, four, five, six are there. What are the prime numbers in this? The prime numbers you have to go. The prime numbers are two. Three and five, which is multiple by itself. You doesn't have more than two factors. Suppose let us take five. One is a factor, and five is a factor. You can't go with the other. Only the two factors you can see. Only the two. If the number is multiple by one and itself. So called prime numbers, prathana sankhya, prime numbers. So that here two, three, five are prime. Numbers. Other than prime are called composite numbers. One, four, six. But but one is not a neither prime nor composite. Remember, because all the time the denominator. Nothing is there. Only the integer it is there means the denominator one. If the number particularly ten it is there means multiple of one. So one never consider I either prime or composite. The composite are only four and six here. More than two, more than two factors called composite. Four we have more than two. How one table here it is going one four zero. Two twos are means two table it is there four ones are four table more than two or not so which is more than two if you have the factors called composite number so four and six are called composite one is not a prime one is not a composite it is okay two three five are prime four and six are prime sorry composite number. Okay, so and natural numbers, you know, one, two, three, four, five, six. Multiples of. You will ask the questions. I will raise the questions before that. I am giving the clarification to you people. So yes, multiples of how many multiples of two are there? Two multiples of two. Two ones are two. Two twos are four. Two threes are six. How many you have? Three multiples of two. How many multiples of five? Only one. Five ones are five. Five twos are ten. Ten is not there. What is the probability of getting the multiples of four? Multiples of four. 
only one. One by six. Because outcomes are there. Outcomes are there here. One by six here. What is the probability of getting the multiple of two? Two, four, six. Three are there. So three by totally six are there. Three by six, nothing but one by two. Three one is three. Two is a six. Three by three by six, nothing but two by. Oh, sorry, one by two. One by. Two. What is the what is the probability of getting the multiple of eight? Multiples of eight. Impossible. Eight, eight ones are eight. Is eight is available? No. It is impossible. Which is zero. Zero by six, nothing but zero again. Outcomes are there. Total outcomes are six. But here there is a multiple of eight. There is nothing. So you have to consider as zero. Zero by six is nothing but zero. Zero by six is nothing but zero. Boys, so these are the uh, right uh, classifications here. Let us go in. Probability of getting the probability of getting the prime number. Of a die, prime number of a die, prime number of a die, one die, nothing but. That is the prime number. How many prime number? Two, three, five. That is the how many? Three. Total how many? Six. That is equal three one is a three. Two is a three one is a three. Two is a that is one by two. If you want to write this one as solution, how you will write? Solution part will be like this here. Uh, number of number of favorable outcomes. Number of favorable outcomes of prime. Otherwise, you can write here number of. Yeah, I will write like this. Okay, number of uh, prime of dice. Other okay, number of favorable outcomes of. Primes, prime of a dice will give the clear, clear classification. How many? Even you can write like this in brackets. You can write that is two, three, uh, five. How many? If you want, no need this one. If you want clear explanation, two, three, five. How many? Three. Two, three, five. Prime number. Prime. Two, three, five. No need otherwise. No need to write. Just uh, say how you will get the three. Three is up here. This one. And uh, total. Total number of outcomes of a die. Of a dice. How many? Six. What are they? One, two, three, four, five, six. That all. Okay, children. And uh, here probability. Probability is equal to a ah, number of favorable outcomes by total number of outcomes. How many favorable number three? This is outcomes of many six. Nothing but one by two. This is the solution. And this is the way to present your solution. First step, second step, third step, fourth step. You have to substitute, and this is fine. In all the cases, it will be like this. Number of favorable. Even you can write like this. Number of favorable outcomes of a dice. Of a dice. If you will give primes, and if you will give like this, that is clear explanation you are giving, and you will get without fail, without full marks, you get. Even if you will not write, also you will get it. But minimum you have to maintain the minimum four steps. You have to maintain number of variable outcomes, total number of outcomes, probability formula, and every case, every case you have to write the formula that is equal to the result. That is equal to result. That is three by six. Okay, so that is like this you have to maintain. So same like that. Suppose I am erasing. All the time you have to go with uh, like this, the state and talking about the state. Now we we'll see the one more time on dice.
yes the probability probability of getting the multiple of 5 of a dash probability of getting the multiple of a dash multiple of 5 of a dash 5 multiple of 5 how many are there 5 ones are 5 5 twos are 10 not 2 that means only one out of how many out of how many total is 6 total is 6 that is 1 by 6 1 is not a how many times your favorable outcomes are one time only you got it in the sense one time only you got it that is nothing but 1 by 6 1 by 6 so same like that here what is the probability of getting the what is the probability of getting the composite number composite number of an ad composite number how many composite numbers are there 6 and 4 4 and 6 how many are there totally 2 out of how many 6 Two ones are two threes, but don't cancel it. But try to write like this. Two ones are two threes, means one third, one by three, one third only. How you will write in the statistical way? Number of favorable outcomes of composite number of a tie is equal to two. Total number of outcomes is equal to six. Probability is equal to number of favorable outcomes by total number of outcomes. That is equal to two by six. Again, equal to one third, one by three. Got it? So, like this, you will go with the one die, only one die. What is the probability of getting the? What is the probability of getting the two and the three multiples? Probability of getting the probability of getting the multiples of multiples of two and three of an ad of a it should be multiple of two and also it should be multiple of three that is two and three multiples of two and three is only six. Because two threes are six, three twos are six. Only one it is there. That is six. That is six. That is only one by out of how many six? Out of how many six? One by three. Property of getting the multiples of two and three. Multiples of two and three. Two ones are two. Okay, fine. Two is there. But three table here it is not there. What you have to do? You have to do that. LCM of two and three. You have to do LCM. You have to do. So that two three is a six only one. Yeah, six it is there. It is so only one chances is there. So one by six you will get only one chance is there. So that one by six. Understand, children? So probability of getting the multiples of two and three of a die is equal to one by six. What is one? That is two 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 three is a three two is a only one number it is there. That is one by six. One by six. So this is the uh, on a one dice. Now we will see the two dice. Now we will see the on two dice. We will see on two dice. On two dice. <coughs> whenever you have a two dice, will whenever you throw that you can see on the top of the face. Ah, uh, one comma one. Let us take as a pair because two dice, na pair. Okay, fine. Otherwise, like this also you can do. One, two, three, four, five, six, and the one. Two, three, four, five, six. Two are there, na? Two dice are there. Two dice are there. So maybe whenever you will throw, you will get maybe one ka one one. The chances are there. This is the first die. This is the second die. One 
maybe the chances you can see what on a face whenever you will throw you can see on that is one 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 dot one dot you can see in the next time if you will throw you can see one dot here two dots maybe you can see one dot two dots also maybe you can see in the third time one dot three also you can see in the fourth time maybe like this in the fifth time maybe like this in the sixth time maybe like this seventh time maybe like this two comma one first day you can see two points the second day you can see one and it is unique and it's a unique the one more time if you will see you can see two comma two or two two next two three next two four next two five like this it will go suppose next time all the third times come thirteenth time if you will do six maybe six six comma one Next six comma two, six comma three, six comma four, six comma five, six comma. Next three comma one, three two, three three, three four, three five, three six. Next four one, four two. Like this, you can see how many times totally? One, two, three, four, five, six. How it is zigzag? Maybe it is the same. Totally. Thirty-six times you can see, thirty-six pairs you can see, thirty-six unique pairs you can see. You can't see that the same. Thirty-six are different. One comma one. Next step. One comma two. Next step. One comma three. One comma four. One comma five. One six. Next two one. Two two. Two three. Two four. Two five, two six, three one, three six, four one, four two, four three, four four, four five, four six, five one. Five two, five three, five four, five five, five six, six one, six six four, six five, and six six, six six. So these are so from top to one, one two three four five six. One more six, more six, more six, more six. All together six, twelve, eighteen, twenty-four, thirty, thirty-six, thirty-six. A unique pace you can see when you have the two dials. When you will have here the two dials. Whenever you will have the two dials, you can see this. Thirty-six variety, thirty-six unique pairs. You can see that when you will have the two dice, this is the way. Okay, children. So on this, we will see some problems. On this, we will see some problems. The most important in this, it will covers all prime numbers, composite numbers, multiples. Everything. Yes, let us see here now. You have to remember this one. All thirty-six pairs you have to remember if you want to go with the problem. Simple, like it's very easy to remember. Yes, let us go here. One on the first. I am not going with the steps directly. I am. I will raise the question and I will say the answer. Yes. Here, two dice on a two dice section. What is the probability of getting the? What is the probability of getting the same number of two dots? Same number. Same number of two dots. It should be same. See, let us take this easy. One comma one is same. Same number. 
we can't see the same again. In here, two comma two is same. Three comma three, four four, five five, six six. So remaining all different. It never be. Here one one two two three three four four five five six six. How many are there totally? Six are. Out of how many? Out of thirty six pairs are there. Six to twelve, eighteen twenty four, thirty thirty six. Thirty six pairs. So six by thirty six. Nothing but six ones are six six are. Nothing but one by six is a result. Don't cancel. Try to avoid with cancellation. Present like that. The solution you have to present like that. Just if you will strike, it looks odd. Okay, fine. So the result same number. Probability of getting the same number of two dice. That is six by thirty six. Six by thirty six. At the six ones are six six are one by six. Suppose if you want to go with the statements, statement with what is the first number of favorable outcomes of same number of two dice is equal to six. Total number of outcomes of two dice is equal to thirty six. Probability of particular event, probability of getting the same number of two dice is equal to number of favorable outcomes by total number of outcomes that is equal to 6 by 36 1 by this is the way to you have to maintain compulsorily in every case you have to maintain the formula that is most important yes. same number of outcomes. got it let me go with one more uh, problem that is what is the probability of getting the prime number of two dice What is the probability of getting the? What is the probability of getting the prime number of two dice? Prime number only prime number it should be. One is a prime no. So you just you should don't see that one number with the one 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 two the pair. Delete that. You should not see because one is not a prime. Okay, fine. I will go with the easy way. Is one is a prime? No, that way you should not see this one. Two is a prime? Yes, you can see. Three is a prime? Yes. Four? No. Five? Yes. Six? That means these three you have to delete. Don't see because one is not a prime, four is not a prime, six is not a. No need to see that rows. Rows. No need. Now comes to this one. Two, one, five. Two is prime, but one is not a prime. One is not a prime. So it's wrong. Is asking what prime probability of getting the prime prime of two dice prime of two dice. See, this is two comma two is prime, two three is prime. This is this is two 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 three is prime and a two five is prime because two four four is not a prime, six is not a prime. You should not see two three. Two 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 three two five. That's it. same like that. Three two three 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 five. Because four is six. No need these all. So same like that. Five two five three five five. These are only the primes. These are only the primes. remaining six. Because four two. Yeah, two is a prime, but four is not a prime. We we give a cross here. Cross. In this three only. In this three. Two one one is not a prime. Three uh, four uh, next five one five is prime, but one is not a prime. Five is prime, six is not a prime. So that's what only primes. A uh, probability of getting prime of two dice, prime of two dice, prime prime of two dice. That is how many you got it? One two three four five six seven eight nine. Out of That is most important. Again, nine ones are nine fours. Are. Is it nine fours or thirty six? Yes, nine fours are that is one by four. One by four. That is one by four. Got it? We'll see one more. That is probability of getting the probability of getting the composite number of a prime. Composite number of a two dice. Composite number. 
composite number one is not a composite no need to check here now we have to delete one we have to delete two we have to delete three we have to delete five only four and six we have from this four and six rows ah uh, four 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 six only two six four six six these are the composite numbers property of getting the composite number of two dice in the two dice we have to see only composite number yes here six is composite but three is not a composite so four 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 six six four six six yeah because four and six only the composite number one is not a composite or a prime two and three are primes five is prime so four and six on four This is four, 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 six, six, four, six, six. Only four are there. Four are there. Four by out of how many? Thirty-six is common. Two dice. Thirty-six is common all the time. Total number of outcomes are thirty-six. That is four ones are four nines are four ones are four four nines are thirty-six. Four nines are thirty-six. So one by nine. One by nine. Got it. That is composite number of a two dice. Composite number of a two dice. So like this, we have to maintain the questions. And one more thing that one more the most important question. Try to learn this, or you want to take one snap, one screenshot. You can have that. What is the property of getting the? What is the property of getting the? Five on a five number on two dice. Five number on two dice. Five number on. Students, five number. It should be five. That page should be five. See, here it is there. One five is there. Five number are two dice. In the two dice, not same number. Five number it should be. Yes, one. Here it is the five. All these you will get. And uh, this totally you will get. That is most important. All these five is there. Here also five is there. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, eleven. What is the property of getting the on a face card, on a face, on a face dice? Five number of two dice. Five number of two. How many total? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Eleven by. Total number of outcomes are thirty thirty six. Total number of outcomes are thirty six. So same like that here. What is the problem we are getting the without the five on two dice? Without the five on already five we got it. Huh? Remaining or without five only? Nothing but how many? Out of thirty six, if you will take eleven, twenty five will be left. Thirty-six minus eleven. That is twenty-five by thirty-six. In the directly, you can only to count direct. Without the five, is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. You should not count twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, and twenty-five by thirty-six. And no cancellation is going on. Twenty-five by thirty-six. Twenty-five by thirty-six, without a five, without five. Okay, children. So last and finally, we'll go with that. <coughs> What is the probability of getting the sum of two dice is seven? Sum of two dice is seven. Sum should be seven. Sum means let us take this one. One comma six. Add that to two. One plus six how much? Seven. 
sum of the two diodes the what is the probability of getting the on a phase on a phase top of the phase whenever you will add that two it should get to seven what is the result that is seven one comma six one plus six how much seven two plus five seven three plus four seven four comma three four plus three seven five plus two seven six plus one something one two three four five six you can't see i think so more than that. yes here it is here two comma four six here two comma six eight whenever you will add the two dice it should get seven it should get seven so that it is nothing but here how many are the six out of how many That is six. Six one to six. So that is nothing but one by six. One by six. Got it? So that is one by six. So like that we had to do. So one more we will see. What is the probability of getting the sum of sum of two dies is forty. Sum of the two dies is forty. What is the probability of getting the pair of two dice? Is fourteen sum? What is that? Six, the largest number let us take. Largest number is six plus six. How much is six plus six? Twelve. What is asking fourteen? There is no such pair. So we we'll call that it zero by thirty six. Nothing but zero, which is impossible event. Which is impossible event. Which is impossible even. So same like that. You have to go with this. And finally, we'll see one more. I got a one more idea. I will. <coughs> what is the probability? What is the probability of getting the multiples? Multiples of three. Of two dice, multiples of three of two dice, multiples of three of two dice. Two dice it should be multiple of three. So one is first of all multiples of three is three and six. Means in this only you have to put. In this also you have to take three comma three because three one is not going two will not go three years and three six three 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 six six three six. Only that. How many are there totally? Four. How? Three comma three, three six. Six three six. Because these two only is going multiples of three. Three two za. Three one za. Three two za. Three one za. Three two za six. So multiples of three. Probability of getting the multiples of three of two dice. How many are there? One two three four. Four by thirty six. Four by out of thirty six. So for ones are for nines are for ones are for same like that here composite numbers here are only composite numbers are what four and six they are ten these two in this four and six four six okay already I think so complicated four 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 six six four six six four are there here is that answer also one by nine what is the probability of getting the sum is sum is ten. Of two dice, of two dice. Sum is ten of two dice. Sum is ten of two. Sum is sum ten. That means two six. Uh, here two plus six. How much eight? Uh, three plus five. Three plus six. How much nine? Here four five nine. Four six. Here from here it will start. Four plus six ten. Five plus five ten. Six plus four ten. That is totally three are there. Four six five five six four. Three by thirty six. One by uh, how much? Twelve. One by twelve. Like this also maybe you uh, will ask that property of getting the sum is more than sum is more than eleven. Sum is more than eleven. What is the probability of getting the sum is more than eleven? 
more than 11 you have to count that sum that means here what is the more than 11 6 comma 4 is 10 6 comma 5 is 11 but he is asking more than 11 6 comma 6 only one bit is there. 6 comma 6 only one that is a nothing but 1 by 36 1 by 36 more than 11 na? more than 11 it is only one 6 plus 6 is 12. The sum is more than 11. That is 12. So like this, you can go with the dice. Even we have the formula for two. Uh, how many, a uh, total number of dice will be there. This is a formula. 6 power n is a formula. Here, we took here what? 6 power 1. How many is it? 6 power uh, 2 dice. 6 power how much? 36. Suppose 3. Suppose three dice will be there. Chances will be 216. 216 chances you will get. Six six are 36. 36 six are 216. 36 six are 216 chances will be there. But you won't get such a way. Just I am saying the formula. That's it. Six power n is the formula because six faces are there. 2 power n is a formula because 2 faces are there in a coin, coin, coin. 2 power n is a formula. Here, 6 power n is a formula. Understand? I hope you understand excellently. Go with the good examples by yourself. Creative, innovatively, that all the questions by yourself. So that you can uh, once you see that whatever related the bias is there. Related the bias, any problems are there in the textbook collect and complete it that one. So, that execution, if you will do, it is better. And also you can raise some doubts. You can even ask the doubts, whatever it is. Okay, children, I hope you understand excellently. And there is a no actually homework uh, because that exam it is not finally can't uh, go with that uh, no more problems here. Collect from the textbook itself, do that all. If you will get any doubts, raise, uh, raise and uh, uh, ask me in, uh, uh, upload that whatever the person you want. Okay, nice children? Fine, we'll uh, end the session today. Thank you.